the escape from this orphanage slash meat farm is getting a little bit more interesting in the Promised Neverland. Now, I do actually want to continue doing this sort of the, at least the Jumpstart initiative that they have, which is normally the first three chapters, and I definitely want to at least talk about the first three of this, because it's definitely got myself interested. I was very much looking forward to the brand new Jump series that they were going to be having, but seemingly all that we're not going to be getting that for a little while longer, Love Rush, and the other one that's going to be appearing. So we're going to be talking about this second chapter instead of the Promised Neverland, starting right about now. So Emma and Norman are kind of trying to like pretend that like none of the shit happened yesterday with like, oh, we found demons, we found a meat packing farm, we all fucking meat like that. And it's just like we got to like pretend like nothing at like ever happened all that. And it's like you know, even they're like you know thinking that their mother and all that, she's still like pretending to be really kind and nice to all the children. And it's like look and all that, we need to get, we want to get everyone out of here and all that. And, you know, we went there and we and planned on escaping. That's why we need to find it ourselves, the way to get out of here, out of everything that's going down. And it's just like, you know, even still, like, you know, Emma was telling, like, I know it's the first time, like, forever and all that this morning and all that. Like, how the windows are bolted and all that and the screws, holes are damaged. And it's just like, you know, even, like, there's really fucked up. And it's like, we don't, we know, like, you know, the reason why, like, we eat so much food and the reason why we have white clothes to show that we're dirty and all that and the regulated life. Yeah, that and also as well, like, the whole branding stuff that we have on our tattoos and all that. That's to show that, yeah, we like to make sure that we're clean stock, but education, what is that for? Like, that that was the one thing where it's like, we don't get why is the education needed at all, because if we, if we think about it, it's like, how does that make, like, the meat, like, higher grade and all that? And it clearly shows and all that, that the fact that, like, the Norman and Emma and all that, they're like, they were going to be the ones shipped with the other boy. It was like, yeah. We, but how does that rank the meat? Does that have something to do, like, where they just get your intelligence or something like that? And it's just like, you know, we get free full marks, so what the hell is going on with that? And it's like, maybe that's the case and all that. And it's like, we still, like, even normal was kind of being kind of clever about it. Even he was saying, like, look, we don't know anything about the outside world and all that. And it's like, you know, even though it's the mid 23rd century and all that, we don't have TVs, we don't have radios, you know. We don't know anything about the outside world. It's just, it's vastly, un like, you know, we don't know if it's even safer to be out there. If you're going to die a lot quicker from there. And even then, it's like, it's the side and all that. It's saying like, we escape during the day through the forest and all that. And it's like, yo, we need to go and find out what's happening. And it's like, there's a wall over there. And it's like, oh, it's pretty high and no guards and all that. And it's saying, like, we can pretty much climb this regardless if we can get a rope. And it's like, oh, we've got, like, yeah, it's going to be fine and all that. And it's like, yeah, everyone's going to be, like, you know, taken care of. If, if we can just get a rope, we can get everyone out of here. And it's just like, and then there was an incident where one of the kids goes missing. And they're, like, going to the mother and all that. And saying, like, oh, what, like, kid, like, Mark's gone. Oh, Mark's gone and all that and she's like don't worry the sun's about to set and it's going to get dark soon and it's just like everyone stay here and all that I'll find it and she brings out a pocket watch and then five minutes later she has the kid already and it's like that yep you know, what the fuck that was too fast like what the hell's going on and all that and it's just like and it's like, and it was like, it's like, no, that mother knew exactly where he was and all that where like you know this child was and it's like that's why and all that because that thing isn't a watch, that's a tracking device and all that, and that's why that brand, they've got something implanted in them to make sure, like some fucking ID chip, to make sure that they always know where the children escape. So they have to deal with either A, they have to somehow remove these tracking devices out of their bodies, which they have no I fucking idea. Like, the best viable solution seems to be like it's maybe on the neck, mainly where that's where the ID thing is at, and two, like, the, uh, the option, which is they probably, it seems more reasonable, but good luck fucking trying to get that version of it, is that you've got to steal the tracking device to make sure that she hasn't got any other way to track down the children. And, it, like, she knows. She clearly knows, as she was looking yesterday and all that, saying, like, there is a child there. And all that, she knew that there was someone who brought the gate other than Connie and all that. And it's like, yeah, it was a declaration of war and all that. No matter who it is, I won't let you escape. That's probably what mom is saying right now. And I'm like, wow. It's like that. That was kind of, I'm kind of like, the, the how it's feeling right now is definitely like, we don't know exactly where it's going to be going because like, the whole gimmick of, like, trying to escape this place 
can't last a lot. Like, uh, that's what I feel like you're saying. Like, you know, obviously the title of The Promised Neverland is, like, it's so far, it's leading up towards, like, you know, escaping from, like, this place. And then that can go even more if the demons are being heavily more involved later on in the, third, like, foreseeable future. Like, The Promised Neverland is, like, a, uh, a world without these demons. That's where, the sh like, the whole series is pretty much going. Like, you can have those two separate meanings from it. So, I'm wondering at the moment, like, uh, like... Because I really don't feel like the gimmick of escaping from this place can like is going to last that long in the series run. Because then it definitely feels like the kids are going to escape, like or like a certain few of them, and like you know only like Emma, Norman, and like the other like the other dude, and like maybe a two like a few of the other kids might escape. I don't think all of them are going to escape, right? And it's like okay, and then they're going to like fight back from the demons and prevent that no other situation where like a meat farm like what they are, like were born in ever gonna suffer again so that's why i want to know what's going to be going on with that so i'm not i did really enjoy this chapter i thought this was a nice one like definitely i was a little bit interested about the tracking device and i was like this is a little bit too easy when the wall was being raw up and it was like there's no guards or anything so like the only thing that they really generally have to take care of is the tracking device that's the only thing they have to do they either have to remove somehow the chips and all that they have on the tracking device to find out but other than that, I, I definitely, I thought it was an enjoyable chapter. So far, this, like, seriously, this has got me interested in all that. Like, so I definitely want to see where it goes and all that. And I'm definitely looking forward to, like, the last chapter they have of the Jump Start run. And definitely as well when we've got more chapters coming out in the foreseeable future and all that. And whether or not the series survives the, the, the very, like, dangerous jump runs and all that. Since most of the new series get cancelled, we'll have to wait and see. But thank you much for watching. As always, let me know what you guys think about the promise of the line in the comment section down below. And I will see you guys, though next time.